King Carlos here. Y'all, this ain't going to be a long video. I'm going to try to get straight to it, bro. If you're going to help a man, teach that man how to fish. Do not give that man fish. What you create is an envious, jealous person who will eventually take your life. This is how you get scenarios where his best friend killed him. Or sometimes it's just he a snake dirty ass nigga like a Al a Alpo, Alpo in a Rich Porter situation. Alpo was just a dirty motherfucker, you know, to sit there and ride around in the car in today's time and talk about how you killed your best friend, you shot in the back of the head and all this over a, a supposed plug or some shit when you guys are both multi-millionaires. It, it just shows that you hate it. You just hate and jealous. You want to kill him anyway. You're just a bloodthirsty, evil motherfucker. And there's some niggas out there like that, but <clears throat> for the most part, that shit is created through um, indifference and action, indifferent actions. And what I mean by that is over t and basically over time, like you start a business, right? And you become the big boss nigga. You got all the paper. And you still want your partner who works a nine to five to, to run with you every day. Oh, but man, you want, since you rich, you want him to up and quit his job. Like he your wife, he, like he your bitch you fucking on or something. Or you, or you got a click of niggas, right? And so y'all don't have to be nine to five niggas. Say y'all all street niggas, bro, and you blow up as a rapper. You blow up as a rapper, bro. This goes back to my 504 situation, right? The, the 504 situation. And you say, you know what? Instead of you hiring security, you want your hitters around you. But you ain't trying to get these niggas in the studio. You ain't trying to help these niggas start a, a clothing line. You ain't trying to help these niggas brand. You ain't posting these niggas on your Instagram page. Yes, five of y'all, I'm talking to you, bro. Real shit, my nigga. You're not helping these niggas it out at all, right? But they dancing in your video. You going to their hood. They showing their Glocks. These motherfuckers have got dirty guns. These niggas is on paper and shit, but they risking all that for your ass, right? To hype your shit up. You blowing up big. You taking all these moves. And you thinking because you giving these niggas money and chains and shit like, uh, like, um, Vaughn was doing it like that. Them niggas happy to stand on the corner and people coming by knowing that you gave them that shit, that that's your shit they in. Like you a female, like they your female or something like that. They riding around in your car, your Benz car that you bought them. They walk around with your chain that you bought them and shit like that. You think, oh, they're going to be satisfied. You should be happy. He's not a female. He's a male. He's going to show you he a male by putting a bullet in the back of your fucking head, my nigga. And if, and if they security for you, which is putting in work for you, my nigga, pay them niggas, bro. That's real. If you go into their hood, pay them young niggas, bro. They got pipes in your video, pay them young niggas, bro. They throwing up gang signs, they got their flags and shit. You know them the niggas that's actually stepping on shit. And you go into a studio every day recording music, living luxurious in your mansion. You got maids, you got bad bitches, you got good food. You, got a, you working out and shit, you living good. These niggas going back to the trenches, jacking off and shit eating syrup sandwiches and all that shit when they money run out that you and give them. And most of these niggas, probably, most of these niggas, even if they hit us, they, probably, they got a little honor in them, so they're going to get most of their paper to their mama anyway, their family, because their family starving. So them niggas still don't enjoy that shit. So they got to come right back to you and beg and borrow and be dirty and grimy for you while you look clean and get all the hoes. You think that shit going to last forever? <clears throat> this is, I'm just letting you niggas know, bro. Y'all think that's going to last forever, bro? Keep this shit real with yourself, bro. Pay them young niggas. Pay them. Any of you rappers that's doing that shit, pay them young niggas, bro. Are they gonna use them pipes on you? Talk about what they do in the club and all that. I don't give a fuck who you is. 21 Savage, you the fuck if you was, you could be, shit, Jay-Z, nigga, you can be, I'm talking about, you could five your form, whoever. And I'm not saying it's like, I'm, a, I'm not trying to say it, I'm just saying, bro. It don't matter what, where you from, what state you in. You can be, I don't give a damn if you fucking, um, I'll say the name of Miami rap or Florida rapper, Young and Ace, whoever, bro. If you're not giving, if you're not gonna teach them niggas how to make money and shit and rap, so they can get out the streets and stop doing that stupid shit with them pipes and shit and get in the studio and shit, get in the yo with you and actually record some shit, build their own fan base and shit. You ain't gonna promote them when they trying to do that shit. At least if they gonna be on the bullshit, pay them to be on that bullshit, my nigga, because you know damn well they deserve it, and that's just real.